Hi, I'm Dr. Stephen Garber. I'm an obstetric anesthesiologist that practices in Orange County, California. I've been in practice over 30 years, and today I want to talk to you about an epidural positioning device called the EpiHug. The EpiHug pillow is very, very useful in labor and delivery. I've been using it for over two and a half years now on all of my patients for spinal and epidurals. It can be used in the sitting position as well as the lateral position. It's very easy to use. The patient simply wraps their arms around the contoured area for the arms. The legs go into the contoured area here, and it's also contoured for the abdomen in this area. What I really like about it, the patient is locked in position. They can extend their chin and rest it here. They're very comfortable. That extension of the chin actually pushes the epidural area out slightly for ease of placement of the epidural. It's cleaned in between uses with a sani wipe. It's made in the USA, and compared to some of the other contraptions I call them for epidural positioning, this is a really, really great way to go. I've got the EpiHug pillow. Let's go see how it's used on an actual patient. Now we're gonna demonstrate the use of the EpiHug with an actual patient. Bree here is in labor. We're gonna show her how to hold the pillow. Contour for the legs goes there. There's a contour for the abdomen as well. You're gonna take, put your arms all the way around that pillow, Bree, and hold it tight, okay? Then you're gonna extend your chin and put it right there, that's perfect. Let's take a look at that from back here. Can you pull your chin back for me? Okay, go ahead and extend and put your chin there. Watch what happens to the lumbar area here. A slight extension of the lumbar area. She's locked into position there. If I need to move her forward or back, I can. She's locked in, if she has a contraction, you just squeeze that pillow. The support person can be in the front here, holding. Also, it frees the nurse up, she doesn't have to do anything. And she's locked in position, I can move her front and back if I have to, and she's all ready for placement of her epidural. All right, now we're gonna demonstrate the use of the pillow in the lateral position. Again, the leg contour goes there. You're gonna put your arms all the way around the pillow, hold it tight, extend your chin and put it right there. Okay, that looks good. Can you pull your chin back again for me? Now go ahead and put your chin on the top. And again, you can see the slight extension of the lumbar area here. Really makes it nice for placement of the epidural. She's locked in position there. You can move her a little bit side to side if we have to. She has a contraction, squeeze that pillow, and she's all ready for placement of her epidural.